What's up, y'all? I'm Julandy. Welcome back to another mock draft. That's right. We did one uh, not too long ago. We have another one right here. And this one will include trades because there's a lot of talk of so many trades, trading up, trading down. Let's jump right into it. Number one, start the draft. Let's go. That's what you got to do first. This is, again, I can't say anything but this. Caleb Williams going number one. They've turned down uh, trades from Washington. I'm sure other teams as well. They're locked in at Caleb Williams. Shout out to the Bears. Just what they need. Now, this is where everything goes crazy. Does Washington trade? Do they stay? Early on, it was Drake May. And then recently, all the smoke screens, Jane Daniels. But then he had a bad interview with them. But hey, maybe it's JJ McCarthy. No. You got to go off what was early on because it is smoke screen season. Drake May, number two. Now, the Patriots. Now, this is where things start to go really crazy. Do they go Jane Daniels? Do they trade down? Where do they go? Now, the Vikings are pushing really, really hard to trade up. But that's not who's going to jump them. It is going to be the New York Giants as I right-click instead of click. So, no, it's not Washington. The Patriots trading with the New York Giants. Uh, now, this don't don't hate me in all, the, all these trades. You know, it's going to be a first... It's going to be multiple future firsts. Uh, probably, honestly, at least two extra first-round picks. Maybe some other things, some swap picks. Maybe get three and they get four. You know, uh, but either way, that's the trade. They go up, and they are going to jump up and take Jaden Daniels. They saw him. They love him. It's not J.J. McCarthy. Jaden Daniels. Cardinals. What do they do here? I think it's simple. They have to go Marvin Harrison. Maybe Malik Neighbors. I like him a lot too, but they're going to go Marvin Harrison, number four overall, Chargers. Now, this is where I think they're also going to trade back. They are going to, I love that this keeps the, the, the same people. Now, it probably will be obviously a lot larger than this, but five for 11 and 23. Because, uh, you know, Harbaugh, he wants to build the draft. He wants to build a nice chunk. So they're going to jump up. They're going to take J.J. McCarthy. Do I think it's crazy that J.J. McCarthy is going in top five? Absolutely. But it, it is what it is. Patriots now on the clock. They're not getting a quarterback. They said, hey, that's not what I think we're going to do. They're going to take Malik Neighbors. Yeah, they're going to try to build through the draft. They're, they're probably going to have another second round pick. Maybe pick a, a Bo Nix, Michael Penix, one of those. But Malik Neighbors goes number six to the Patriots. Tennessee. Tennessee, they need all hands to tackle. This is they're sitting pretty right now. They take Joe Alt. Atlanta, Atlanta could go a lot of different ways, a lot of different ways. I really like Dallas Turner because that's that's their biggest need right now is, is that edge. So do they take the first defensive player? I think they do. I think they do. Now Chicago, here's what's uh, interesting. I think they're going to trade this. I think they're going to trade this pick to. The Chargers, because the Chargers are going to trade back up, jumping. Who am, I, who am I trying with? I already forgot. Chicago, that's right. So jumping up 11, 109, uh, maybe it's a third and a fifth. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't know. Bears are kind of recapping, getting some extra draft capital. Capital? I said that super weird. Chargers are going to leapfrog the Jets to take Brock Bowers, because I think the Jets would love to take Brock Bowers, uh, number 10. But the Chargers jump back up. To take. So not only do they trade down, they get their guy they wanted, but they pick up an extra first round pick as well. So the Jets, oh man, we missed out. What are we going to do? We're a little bit lost. They go room. Dunze cannot let him fall anymore. Still receiving threat. Aaron Rodgers, weapons galore. Chicago, they've traded down a couple times. And they're going to take Jared Verse. They're happy with how they fell. They may we're going to take him at number nine. They say, hey, we'll just drop down, pick up a couple extra picks. So they get Jared Verse. Denver, upset, missed out on the uh, quarterbacks. You know, do What do they do? Trade up, trade down. They will trade down. Y'all aren't going to believe it, but the Seattle Seahawks are going to trade up. Seattle never trades up. Like, ever, ever. But guess what? Uh, what's his name? Uh, Pete Carroll's out of there. Um, I don't know. It's a third, maybe a fifth going back. Yeah, uh, whatever it is. They're not jumping too, too crazy. It could be a second. They don't have any seconds. Future second. I don't know. But they're jumping up because they're gonna take uh, Fashanu, not Fashan or Fashanu, Fashanu. Fash is that what it is? It, it was one way for a while, and then he told us at the combine, and then uh, I, I forgot what it was. Raiders on the clock. They're upset because they just got leapfrogged. So they're gonna take their their backup tackle, Fuega. 
Saints, 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 Saints. The run on offensive tackle has devastated them. Do they want to take Troy Pino? They really, really kind of don't. But that's who they're going to take. J.C. Latham was in consideration, but no more. Colts, they need a cornerback. Turn Arnold. Uh, easy, easy, peasy. Broncos back on the board. And guess what? This is where Michael Penix, his fall stops. It's crazy to think that Michael Penix is going in the first round. I, I like him as, as a player, but I'm not investing a first-round pick in him. If he makes it to me in the second round, I'll give it a go. I, I, yeah. There's a lot of injury question marks, age, all that. Has he already peaked? Now, Jaguars love how this has fallen. They're going to get Quinion Mitchell, cornerback from Toledo. I absolutely love it for them. Uh, that's, a, that's just a match made in heaven. It's exactly what they need. Cincinnati also loves how this has fallen. They take Brian Thomas Jr., a perfect T. Higgins replacement. If T. Higgins does get traded, uh, something tells me he will. It could be actually during the actual draft. Who we got next? The Los Angeles Rams. Guess what? They need edge. And guess what? Latu Latu still here. They take him. Pittsburgh. Off to tackle. Guess what? Jason Latham still there. The perfect draft. And guess what? Byron Murphy to the Miami Dolphins. Perfect. Uh, the, the, all these teams are like, this is perfect how everything falling. All the trades up and down. Philly. Cooper DeJean, do they take him? No, they're going to go Nate Wiggins. They want high upside, so they're going to go high upside. Chargers back on the clock. They could use a lot of different things uh, here. Wide receiver is one of them. They just got Brock Bowers. And guess who's still here? A.D. Mitchell. Absolutely love A.D. Mitchell. Um, I would love for my team to take him, but I don't think they'll be able to get him whatsoever. Cowboys. Cowboys on the clock. They, they need a lot. They're going to take our Marius Mims. They're going to Georgia to help shore up their offensive line woes. Man, I can't believe how this is going to fall, but Kool-Aid McKintry is going to Green Bay Packers. Kool-Aid is going to be real cool up there in uh, Lambeau Field. Here we are with the Buccaneers. Now, here's I'm going to go a little crazy. Buccaneers, they're going to take Xavier Worthy. They saw the speed. They said, we want that. Mike Evans, not really fast anymore. Chris Godwin, great route runner, not really fast anymore. Then he wants someone to take off the top, and that's Xavier Worthy. Cardinals back here. What do they do? What do they do? I think they go into your offensive line. They need it. Jackson Powers Johnson. Absolutely love him. Some people say he could even go inside the top 15. I don't think that, but hey, uh, <laughs> what do I know? My goodness, the Bills. Bills fans, I am so sorry. Y'all actually could have traded up to, um, to maybe take Xavier, but I, I don't I don't think so. So Buffalo, here's what's going to happen, though. Here's what's going to happen, though. We're gonna, they're going to trade, and you thought you would never see it. The Buffalo is going to trade with Kansas City. Because Kansas City, so 132, third, fifth, as well as another fifth going, whatever the trade is. Don't worry about the details, okay? Don't, don't freak out. Because they want a wide receiver, and really the last probably first round receiver is Lad McConkey. He goes there, little trade uh, from the Bills. Detroit. Now Detroit honestly sitting real pretty, especially because Cooper Dijon still there. What a pick! They're happy with how that fell. Baltimore, 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 Baltimore. Tyler Guyton's there. I think that's what they're gonna go with. Beautiful pick for them. San Francisco. They again need offensive linemen. They're kind of upset. Oh, they were going to take Guyton. Maybe they should have jumped Detroit for that. But they didn't. Of course, we can't really go into the second round. Maybe we could go into the second round uh, for something. That'd be kind of fun. Uh, but for San Francisco, uh, I really think... It was like Graham Barton. I think we need in yeah, yeah, yeah. Graham Barton. Graham Barton. Helps some of the emphasis. And then poor, 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 poor <laughs> Buffalo Bills fans. Team has been decimated, making like, all kinds of trades. Um, they actually go, yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's give them uh, Rake Shaw Jr., one of the higher upside players in this draft. I could see him being hey, a, a top you know, 15 corner in the league. I could see him also being cut in two years. But that's what they're going to go with. So let's go a quick uh, recap here. Lots of trades. Lots of trades. Uh, the Patriots traded down. The Chargers traded down and then traded back up. Let's go to the first round. Pick my goodness ads everywhere. That's what happens when you don't pay for things. Caleb Williams, Drake May, Jane Daniels, Harrison, uh, the Giants training up with the Patriots. Uh, J.J. McCarthy, big trade from the uh, Vikings with the Chargers. Take J.J. McCarthy. Malik Neighbors to the Patriots after that trade down. Joe Alt, Dallas Turner to the Falcons. Brock Bowers after the Chargers traded back up with the uh, Chicago Bears. Take Brock Bowers. Roman Dunze to the Jets. 
Uh, number 10, uh, giving some more weapons for, uh, what's his face? Uh, Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> That's what we just call him for now. Just what's his face? It's what's his face, Rodgers. Jared verse to the Bears after trading back down. Seahawks doing what they never do, trading up to take Fash. No. Fashanu? Fashanau? Not Fashanau. Fashanu? No, Fashanau. I think it's what it's supposed to be. I'm confused. And Fawaga, so quick little run of offensive tackles. Uh, Fontenu to uh, the Saints. Arnold to the Colts. Penix to the uh, Broncos after they traded down. I uh, ended up taking him there. Uh, Quinnell Mitchell, maybe my favorite pick uh, in the draft right there. Uh, Brian Thomas Jr., little replacement for the uh, the Bengals. Latu Latu. Uh, honestly, Latu Latu, I would not be surprised if he goes inside the top 10. He could go where Jared Verse is going. Uh, I, I really think so. You, you, those guys are interchangeable, I think. Uh, JC Latham to the Steelers. Byron Murphy, match made in heaven for the uh, the Dolphins. I could see him going early, too. It's such a weird draft where I think there's like 25 really good players and there's like a little bit of a drop-off. It's, it's going to be very interesting. Uh, so AD Mitchell to the Chargers. Love that. Love that. Mims to the Cowboys. Kool-Aid to the Packers. And to close it out, some trades here at the end. Uh, leapfrogging some of the players to take Loud McConkey. Really jumping in front of the, the Bills. Who are the Bills trade with? They trade with the, the them? They jumped in front of them? Anyway, doesn't matter. They needed to get a wide receiver. Um, I actually, I think I meant to trade with the Cardinals. Anyway, it doesn't matter. doesn't matter. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. That was a super fast mock draft. Took all of what, 12 minutes. So thank you all for watching, and we will see you next time.